Okay, it's a little noisy, but it is home. Okay, you're doing good there. Let's throw this. Oh, we could have ridden him all the way. Uh, we don't really have a good base at the other end. But let me sort my pack and then we'll figure out what we're going to do, okay? Okay, he's safe. Let's just, just toss this in here because we are. Oh, I'm going to build a fence. I uh, built gates, so we'll figure that out at a later date. Anything else we need to take? Take our. No, we'll leave our bucket. We can make a new one. Um, yeah, okay. I am going to head back to the overworld because I just need a break. My nerves are shot. So I will meet you. Hey, where's our compass? Did we leave that somewhere? Oh man. Ugh, I bet we left it at the other chest. Oh man. Okay, crying obsidian. <laughs> Okay, I will meet up with you in just a moment. Okay, I think I would really like my compass back, and I don't know where it is. It's not in either of these chests. I don't think I would leave it on a path somewhere. What I think I've done is left it over at the, our, our other base, but not in the bottom. I think I've left it up in the top. So we'll have to go over. Yeah, it's not here. So I'm going to head back there. I'm going to take uh, Murgatroyd with me here. Oh, I haven't changed. Oh, where are you going? Ooh, that's dangerous. Get out of I shouldn't do that. It'd be just my luck, I would. Oh, uh, okay. You've really got to change those. Okay, I'm going to head over there and then I will. Oh, just like that meet up with you when I get there. Yeah, it doesn't look like it's down here. So we are going to head up to see if it's in the ch chest up here. Oh, well, that's interesting. It's not there either. Okay. Um... Let's check and see if it's in the overworld. You know, I think we need a better variety of villagers. What's this guy? Is he a Fletcher? Let's see, a Fletcher would be kind of cool. Hmm. Sometimes they'll trade just regular sticks for emeralds. Hmm. But we need... We just need... I'm getting hungry. We need more guys, and this this here looks like a good area to set up a whole bunch of workstations. Maybe make another thing like that. Maybe have that for the farmers and guys, the, what do they call them, butchers and things. And over here we can have the armorers and um, more of the tradespeople. And over there we'll have the librarians and the cartographers and even the fletchers and stuff. So we could really get this city to grow quite a bit. 
and I gave up looking for my compass. I'm, it's somewhere, and we'll find it eventually. But I made a new one. So when we oh, I need a max. So when we head back to the Nether, we will. I don't know what we'll do. I'm not going to worry about it too much right now. Ooh. But I would like to get more of my stuff enchanted. Oh, this just takes too long. Let's just make one. Okay, there we go. Yeah, so I might see about setting up some tables here. Then we'll head back to the nether and go to our other base. And then I want to make, like I've said earlier in this, I want to make a perpetual furnace. We could do it here, but yeah, I kind of like the way this is looking. And the, the furnace is going to be kind of a messy thing. Well, it's big anyways. Yeah, he snuck in there. I left the gate open and he got through. Hopefully he'll jump out sometime, but I don't think he will. So we'll just leave him. He can't do too much damage. Okay, so I'm going to work in here for a bit. And then we will head back to our other base and see how that goes. So just give me a minute to get some things set up. Oh, and I would like to go to that spider spawner we found. Yeah, we don't have a lot of cats in here. Interesting. Yeah, so I want to get that... Sp oh, and we need cobble too. What did I want to do? I was going to... We still have another... Oh, I want to go back to that bastion. I want to get that thing set up, clear it out a little bit so I can fig find my way around in there a little bit easier. I don't think we have any... No, I think we took all our cobble with us before. Hmm. Yeah, I may have to go get more cobble. Wow, a lot of coal. And emeralds. Just hoping the the uh, wandering trader will come back. Okay, gonna do some work, and I will meet back up with you when I've got something to show you. You can go home anytime, buddy. Ah, hmm. We get we got chains, didn't we? And I think I left them somewhere. Yeah. Darn it. That would be great to have a lantern hanging from there. And eh, we'll get it eventually. Oh, what's going on up there? Nothing. Okay, so I came down here. <laughs> I came down here to get some cobble. And I thought, well, why don't I clear out this area while we're waiting for the cobble? And we are at level 14. And we are getting rain down here. I'm not sure why in that particular place. It's not dripping, it's just rain. I can even hear it. That is weird. See, these are the things I show you, because if I was to tell you that it was raining down here, you probably wouldn't believe me. I'm having a little trouble believing it myself. Okay, I'm going to carry on. Weird. Just in these three blocks. One, two, three, four. Nothing above us. Okay. Carry on. Weird stuff. Okay, here's the plan with this spawner contraption. Spiders have a bad habit of climbing up the walls and sticking to the roof. So we are not going to give them a way to do that. We are going to put buckets of water along there and it'll all be flowing down here and we'll put buckets of lava across the back and I'm hoping I can make it so that it pushes everything in this direction and then we will set back in here we'll have um, a couple little um, fence posts so that they can get close to us but they can't get us and then we'll just whack them and maybe we'll put some hoppers underneath to collect all the string 
and we will get the XP. So I created this little tunnel here, and it comes out right here. I'll put a little bridge across there, I think. So right to our... Is it raining? Yeah, it looks nighttime. Right to our little base here. I had to take my frost walker boots off. They kept freezing the water. So yeah, this seems like it'll work out pretty good. I had a couple spiders spawn in here already. And I had one spawn with a skeleton on his back. So we will eventually fill all that in. And go from there. Oh, and by the way, we are working in Snapshot 20W20B, which just came out. I think there is... Oh, we got to stop water from... Or spiders from crawling up this wall. Uh, I don't know, but I don't think spiders can climb up glass. I'll have to check that, because that would be the other thing. I could just put glass along both these walls, have the water come this way, put glass on this wall, and then they can't climb up, but the water would actually push them towards us. Not that we really, really need it to, because if we're standing right here, they're probably going to want to come to us anyways. But I'll poke around with some different ideas. So check out that glass option. We have lots of glass. And go from there. So I will meet back up with you when I've got this thing either up and running or close to up and running. Let's go see if it's daytime. Go get some glass. Okay, I'll be... Oh, I guess I could have gone underneath. Okay, I'll be back. And the verdict is... Daytime. Okay. Oh, I should take some cobble up with me. Okay, I'm going to take care of all that, and I'll be back. Well, I bet you'll never guess where I am. This doesn't look familiar at all, I bet. And that's because you haven't seen it yet. This is our viewing window of the spider spawner room. We have this cute little area up there don't like things sneaking up behind me. And this is going to be the spawning chamber of the spider spawner room. We are going to put... Okay, before I say what I'm going to put, I did discover that spiders can climb up glass. They can actually climb up any solid block. Uh, unfortunately, they can climb up some blocks that they're not supposed to be able to, such as water. They're not supposed to be able to, but I did a little testing, and they can, which is very disturbing. Which means I just have to try a little harder or had to come up with a different idea. So, what we did, I'll have to take those down, but we are going to put water all along the top, and it will flow down. The spiders aren't actually going to flow anywhere. They will actually climb to the top. This is I did some tests, and this is what I found. They will climb to the top and then fall down and actually take a little bit of damage. But, uh, what can I say? Better them than me. Oh, really? That shouldn't have come out that far. Let's try that again. Or does it? Wait a minute. Let me think about that. Yeah, it does, but I don't want it to. Not, not here, anyways. Uh, let's see. Block there. That should stop it. Really? Um, I just don't want it. Hmm. Did I not think this through? Well, that wouldn't be the first time. Oh yeah, it's okay if it goes there. Now, I don't mind if I put a str spring there so that I can Okay, so far so good. Shouldn't come out on... You better not come out onto the floor. I kind of need those torches. Let's put one right there. This is going to take a while. But let's just see if we can get this to work. I can't see. I guess that's where... It, oh, that's weird. That's weird too. Uh, nothing really surprises me anymore. Okay, so if that is like that, what will happen when I take these away? Oops! <gasps> no, that's not good. 
you've got to stop it from putting out these torches. And I don't really want it back there. Well, how did that happen? Ugh. I think we might have to start over here. Okay, I am going to... As long as nothing spawns. I'm going to play around a bit. I wonder why that didn't spread. Look at that. Didn't even get that torch. And it really should have. <sighs> okay, I am going to play around until I can get the water stream right. I have been able to do it in when I was testing it. But we just got to make sure things don't spawn before I'm quite ready for them. I'll put one there. Okay, I'm going to try this again. I guess it doesn't matter if they come out, if the water comes out here a bit. Okay, I'm going to work on this and I will be back when we've got it solved. I would think so. Oh, I guess. Better get some water. They might start spawning. I don't think it'll be too, too dark down here. Oh, then again, maybe it will. Okay. One. Oops. I think one just spawned. Whoa. No. Hey, 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 hey. You can't shoot them off. Whoa! It's a little darker than I thought. I really would like that torch though. I'm kind of short of torches right now. Let's go up and have a look. Okay. There we go. Okay. I wonder if they'll climb the water. Let's see. They should actually just come over here to me. 
Hey, hold on there. Spanky. Where'd that other guy go? Oh! <laughs> oh, I didn't actually finish showing you everything I've got down here. See, we'll be able to get XP, string, and... Oh, hit them with a shovel. And spider eyes. Not that we actually need the spider eyes. Wouldn't mind the string. See, you can hear them getting injured as they fall, so it won't be so hard to kill them. Whoops, if they come over here. I know I've done traps before that aren't quite as complicated as this one, but those actually involved a big ditch where they fell down a whole bunch of sp spaces. Then they got injured and came up eight strings. See, we'll be able to make fishing rods and stuff. This we are going to turn into an enchanting room. We'll put an enchanting table here, bookshelves around the outside, an anvil there. Uh, maybe, I don't know. I don't know what else we'll bring in here. See, we won't collect everything. I could put, whoa, I could put, um, what do you call those things? A hopper underneath, like just a couple hoppers down here. But, eh, I think we'll do okay. I didn't see what our, hello boys. Ooh, good reach. Yep, yeah, so I could sit down here, get XP. Whoop. They can't get me, I can get in there. I'm not going to use my diamond sword on these guys. I'll just. Oh, well, maybe I will. Maybe I'll just enchant a really nice sword, Bane of Arthropods, and we'll be set. Hmm. I don't want them to be able to go up. I need to get in there. Well, I've only got one. Oh no, that's the right kind. Okay, we've got to get in there and put that along the top. Hmm, how are we going to do that? These guys don't see to. We need to kill them quickly. What's our quickest way to kill them? Probably that. Whoops, there's still guys in here. Hey, oh, oh, you made me miss. Whoa, this isn't good. Just going through. <sighs> okay. Now i got to get that piece back. Oh, it's right there. Okay, that won't be too hard. Uh, food, that's what I wanted to do. Yes, we definitely need a different sword. We're going to reach that one. <gasps> Where did that block go? Okay, we're going to have to do some drastic measures here. Sorry, buddy, but... get this one down. Okay, you go up there. Did I get it back? No, I didn't. How rude. I don't even know where it went. Okay, let's make a couple more. How's our health? Oh, we're doing good. I need a sword with fire on it. Well, I just need a bane of arthropods. See, we should be able to do that and that. Now, they shouldn't be able to climb up anymore. Let's test that out. They'll go up, hit the roof, come down. Nice. One shot, one kill. Like I say, even if we don't, if we don't get all the string, what have we got? We've got 27 already. So, whoops, nice. Okay, let me just think about how I'm going to do this, and I will be right back.
Give me a couple minutes in here, actually. Let's see if we can get up to 30. There we go. Level 30. Whoa! There's more guys out there than I thought. Getting a bit of lag right now for some reason. Not quite sure why. Let's see, what else have we got? We have, come on. Ooh, look at that. 76 string, 24 eyes. Little beady eyeball spider eyes. Okay, so this is, I mean, this isn't the best way to get XP. It's not that efficient. But it works. Because every once in a while, you got to watch, it does spa spawn a spider jockey. So we get in here and we got a skeleton riding a spider. Oh, I wonder if we got... Oh, there was... See, there was arrows in there. Did you see those? That was from that skeleton. So if we got a, a bow from... Not a bow, a pitchfork. Tried it. I wonder if we could go through more than one spider at a time. Oh well, might have to try that out someday. So here's the other thing. The problem I'm having with the water is it wasn't supposed to come out two blocks. It was only supposed to come out one. And that's because when I did my testing, I made it slightly different. I should have, instead of putting the water right in the corner, I should have knocked it back one block and then the water would have come out just run down and then gone forward one block. So I kind of botched it up. I don't know if I'm going to... Let's we can get a sort of sweeping edge. We can kill these guys. Imagine sweeping edge and Bane of Arthropods. I bet I could hit a whole bunch of them at once. But as you can see, this is working pretty good. We're almost at 31. Oh, and if you're wondering why I have stairs here, that's because I... That was interesting. I guess he drowned. That was because I didn't really want this, the um, fences here to connect. I wanted that little gap in there so that if I needed to, I could reach through there. So we know, we all know that fences do not attach to stairs. So that's why the stairs are there. But yeah, so this is working pretty good. So I am going to... I've got to head back, get some books, and then we can finish off the enchanting table. Like I say, I'll see if I can make a sword with Bane of Arthropods and go from there. So I'm going to do a little bit more playing around here. Because I also don't want to wear out this bow. This is a pretty darn nice bow. What have we got on it? Okay, I can never remember it. Yeah, if we could duplicate this bow, I would be happy. So we've got to find a different way to kill these guys. So. I'm going to, oops, go and look after that. And that's going to be the end of this episode. It's gone on a little too long. But I'll get some stuff done and come back and see what I'm doing in the next episode. Like I said, I do want to go back to that bastion and see about getting that a little more manageable. And I want to, I never thought to go and check out that chest that's right in the metal, middle of the that room. That might, that might have some really good loot in it. Getting all tongue-tied here. Been fighting too many spiders. Oh look, we're already up to 31. Okay, I'm gonna head off, do some stuff, and I will be back. I hope you come back to see what's going on. So from the Spider Spawner XP farm, as always, thanks for tagging along. Hey guys.